All right, man. So it seems like everything's all good between Kiki Palmer and her baby daddy, Darius Jackson. So them two, they went through a very nasty breakup, man. That was, uh, I believe, last year. They went through a crazy breakup. They talked shit about each other. You know, actually, uh, Kiki Palmer um, had a restraining order on, on Jackson, on Darius Jackson. So... They both have a child together, so they were spotted together. It seems like, you know, everything's all good. They were, oh, let me see. They were spotted together having some family time, which is great. To me, I'm not mad at it all because they have a child together. We do not need another Pukisha or another Puki in our, in our society. We need both parents to raise the child. So it's very important that they both came together to raise the child. So... Another thing is like, yo, one thing I've noticed, right? When two people, couples, are fighting, right? Please do not try to pick side. Do not try to pick side. If you're going to pick side, do it covertly. Don't make it public because you might end up being the loser. Not being the loser, bro. You know, at the end of the day, like right now, like them too, right? Now they got back together. I believe there were people picking side or oh, talking shit about like, Maybe talking shit about Kiki. Maybe there were people talking shit about Darius. Now they get back together. What you gonna say though? You gonna feel like a fool, you know, hanging around them too when you talk shit about one of them when they were not together. So now they look at you like, dude, like, yeah, to me it's like, yo, don't ever pick side, man. If two people are fighting, you know, they're in a relationship because you never know they might go back together, man. You never know about relationships, man. Just... Be quiet. I mean, I'm not saying be quiet. Yeah, you can always, like, express yourself, you know, give advice or, or whatever, you know, have your inputs uh, regarding the situation. But if you're going to do it, do it covertly. And also another thing, like, let's say, um, you know, you you pick, like, um, let's say you pick Darius Jackson's side. And do not talk shit about Kiki Palmer to Darius. Do not say, oh, you know what, yeah, she's a biatch. Whatever, or she's a whole, you know, she be no don't 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 even try to say that. Don't say that because usually the person like especially when the breakup is like fresh, fresh, they're not completely done with each other. They are not. So you talking ish like that, you might you might even lose your relationship with the boy. Or you the, 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 whoever you picking side to, yeah? You pick the side. So yeah, if you're gonna say you're gonna talk about things, just don't bash the other party, don't talk shit about you know, the other guy, you know, the person's, like, partner or whatever, just, you know, give advice, but just don't talk shit because at some point you might look foolish, though. Like, right now, like I said, there have been people who have been talking shit about one of them or both of them. Now they got back together. Look at them smiling all happy, though. And they're probably going to clap chicks oh. for sure. You know oh. that. And you know them breakup sex. Ooh. Ah, them breakup sex are so good. Oh, they might make another baby. You'll be surprised. She's pregnant again. They look like they they happy. They're like, oh shit, we finally got back together. So, um, she actually revoked. I know revoked. She dropped. Uh, there was training order against him. So now everything's all Gucci, man. Everything's all good. So, yeah, man. Uh, which is good, but um, I think they both. They both they both kind of st- toxic though. I think the issue with Kiki Palmer and Darius because she makes more money than him, so she does not respect him like that. And him, the fact that you know he's he's, he's doing okay, man. The young brother is doing okay. You know he's trying to make it, but he hasn't made it yet. But since he doesn't not make that much money as her, she I mean he does not have enough power though. She uh, she's the one who's wearing uh, wearing the belt. You know, wearing the pants in a relationship, I'll say. Um, yeah, it's not a good position to be at, especially being a man. It's always better um, for a man to make more money than a woman because as a leader, you know, if you make more money, it makes it easier for you to lead the relationship. If the woman makes more money than you, it makes it kind of hard. Some women, they'll be okay. You still feel like you're the leader. You feel like you have power, but for the most case, it doesn't work that way, man. For the most case, if you don't make much money as the woman, 
yeah, you you gonna you gonna be in trouble, man. The relationship might not work for the most part. Relationships, um, do not work if the woman makes more money. There's always exception to the rule, but yeah, for the most part, that's what it is. But um, yeah, they both got back together. I mean, it's not official yet that like they back 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 together, but. You know, they were spotted, you know, having a great time together. So, to me, I'm pretty sure they got back together. I'm pretty sure they them clapping them chicks, though, because none, none of them has moved on, though. Publicly, I will say. They probably, you know, clap chicks left and right, uh, you know, we didn't know. Uh, but, um, especially for Darius, I'm pretty sure he got some, you know, he got some ass out there, man. Probably Kiki couldn't, you know, maybe, you know, women always, like, take the time. Most women, not all, especially, yeah, modern women nowadays don't have time to waste but most women, they'll take the time before they, you know, the, the bus are open again for the next guy. But uh, I don't think Kiki did it. Uh, if she did, I mean, <laughs> what am I supposed to say, man? Who am I even to stop that? If it happened, it already happened. But anyhow, um, like I say, it's not confirmed that they got back together. Maybe they just put the differences to the side. They decided to come together for uh, their child. But they might not be even be they might not even be in a relationship like that. They're just gonna do it for the child. But um, we don't know. But they look very happy, which I agree. I said at the beginning, it's good for the kid. It's good for our society because we do not need more pukishas or more pukis. We already have enough of them. Enough of them already. So that's good. Hopefully, you know, this lasts at least another eighteen years until the kids are a little older. But it's tricky to me. I, I don't see it because, you know, it was a physical abuse in a relationship. There was so many things happened, man. I know people can grow. I know people can change. But um, it hasn't even been a year or a couple years yet. It's kind of fast. The change, you know, happened kind of fast. But if it's a real change, I'm all for it. That's great. That's amazing. But, um, you know, we can just hope for the best. That's all I can say. And let's just wait and see, though. Let's let's just wait and see. Hopefully, they last this time, man. And that's all I have to say about them, too, man. Other than that, I'll catch you next time. Peace out, family. Uh.